food drives, scholarships, spaghetti, and much more to come on today's news. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning. It's Friday, and I'm your host, Julia. As always, it's your other host, Violet. The DECA students will be visiting the Today Show Plaza this Friday morning. So if you watch, look for familiar faces. Reminder that the food drive will conclude on Thursday, December 12th, so make sure to bring in items for your community. For lunch today, in lines 1 and 2, quesadilla. Line 3, soup and salad bar. Line 4, oven-baked chicken or calzone. Line 5 is closed. There's no birthdays today. Now to sports. Thanks, guys. As you were coming in today, the weather was at a 44 with wind speeds plus 15. Later on today, we should get low of 22. That's it for weather. Now to sports with Abby. Thanks, guys. JV girls basketball versus Delphi lost 29 to 22. Karina Alanis had 10 points and Ariana Regalado had 8. Varsity lost 56 to 28. Liz Sandoval had a season high 15 points to lead the offense. The swimming team split their meet with West Lafayette last night. The girls won by the score of 125 to 51. They accomplished their season goal of three wins. Congratulations, girls. The boys lost to a very strong West Lafayette team by the score of 147 to 38. Their next meet is Tuesday, home against Southmont. The wrestling team will be traveling to Western Boone tomorrow for the Western Boone Invitational. Good luck. There is a boys basketball game tomorrow night against Western with JV starting at six, varsity starting at 730. Make sure to go out and support your dogs. That's it for sports, now back to the studio. If any student is interested in studying abroad during high school or taking a leap year before college, there is money available. Scholarships go unfilled every year, not enough qualified applications. The state of Indiana is part of the selective few states that help offer these opportunities. If you have any questions about it, please go see Ms. Manwani. There will be an all-you-can-eat spaghetti supper to benefit the Clinton County Special Olympics. It will be held Friday, December 13th at the Connecting Point Church, located here in Frankfurt at 400 South 3rd Street. Hours are from 5 to 7.30 p.m., and tickets are 9 at the door and $7 in advance with adults, with kids from 4 to 12 being $5 and kids under 4 eat free. Baked goods will also be available for purchase, so make sure to come and enjoy some delicious food. This weekend is here, so don't get too crazy. Make sure to come to school Monday for more of your favorite news. That's all, hot dogs. See you around. Okay. I touched my first.